morning. <laughs> I'm so happy about this little tree. <laughs> he looks a little bit weird, but <laughs> but still, I think it's cute. It's nice to have something Christmassy in my studio. <laughs> Good morning, welcome to another studio vlog. Today is Tuesday and I'm about to start working. I have quite a lot um, orders that I need to prepare to ship today and then I uh, really need to draw for my uh, patrons. Yeah, uh, yesterday I've done I've done a wallpaper and also the printable is ready but I would like to uh, draw for the sticker clubs. As you know I have uh, three sticker clubs uh, so there are a lot of uh, stickers to, <laughs> to draw. I really would like to do it today so then tomorrow um, in the evening I will probably make the digital version and then tomorrow I can uh, cut them and probably either tomorrow or, or Friday I will like to send them out. There is a lot to do, let's start to work!
Good morning, it's Thursday, it's uh, 9 o'clock. I'm about to film a video for Cricut. I mean, uh, the guys from Cricut wanted to send me some products and they also sent me a Cricut maker, so um, a machine. I used to have uh, the Silhouette Portrait too, this one over here. It's a little bit old, it has already three years and uh, lately it has become so loud and I start to feel a little bit uncomfortable when I use it because they really start to give me headaches. So uh, I'm really happy that the guys from Cricut wanted to send me a machine to try it out, to make some comparison, to make some videos for you. So I will be filming a video today, um, like an unboxing and a first uh, setup and let's see if this machine will be like a nightmare to set up uh, like this one uh, was so for me to like start using right the silhouette machine it took me probably months so to figure out how to how to cut properly it's also true that it was the first time for me to have uh, such a machine so probably with a second one would be more intuitive i don't know so i'm a bit scared about the, the change because now i have all my stickers prepared and all the files are already set with the silhouette so i don't know if the the change from silhouette to cricut will be painful so <laughs> i'm a bit scared uh, but still i'm really curious to try out a new machine and i really can't wait to show you also how it is and to make some some comparison with the, with the machine so if you are in the stage of choosing a machine you can see more and try to decide uh, together with me and also i received uh, another thing that i will show you uh, really soon then i would like to have some time to prepare the stickers for my patrons the designs are done yesterday in the evening i <laughs> i drew a lot on the ipad uh, while i was watching a tv series so i'm ready i think i i really think i'm ready so i just need to print and cut and then tomorrow uh, probably i will prepare uh, for the rewards to go out and but yes i want to show you something so this is the box of the cricut cricut maker as you can see and this box box is standing here uh, since friday so it's already like five days and my husband told me yesterday i don't know how can you have something new and not want to open it right away but really i wanted to film this video so today is the day and i will finally open this and then yesterday this one arrived because uh, this is not gifted this i bought it with my own money i wanted to invest in a better printer so i i bought an epson eco tank 80 ET7700. Yes, I wanted to invest a little bit in my in my business and this can also be my own <laughs> Christmas gift. So today I will also try to set up uh, this guy and I really hope I can have better quality of course with the printing and with stickers and this is also nice because you can save on the cartridge because you have this kind of bottle that you um, can use. You have here the storage for the for the ink and the ink is liquid and you just pour it in many people told me that it lasts forever so it's also nice not to have too many cartridge and uh, so i'm really curious to see how it works i really hope this has been a, a good choice so let's see but now i will uh, start with the other video and then i will come back here and we will open this together so I've just finished to film the video about the Cricut Maker. I really hope I can uh, upload it to YouTube this week as well. So now my studio is a little bit all over the place. I had to move everything from here to get some space from for this machine that it's actually quite quite huge, as you can see. It's not really uh, so big <laughs> in comparison to that one. Look how, how small it is, the silhouette portrait so far i've done some stickers to uh, try it out and it was really intuitive really easy to cut through but 
Now I will need to uh, experiment a little bit more and make some kiss cut uh, stickers and figure out how to cut also sticker sheets, etc. So I think it will take me quite some time, but for a first experiment and only to uh, cut stickers, it was really, really easy and intuitive. Also, the software is so far really amazing, looks really amazing to me. Just a quick, I will quickly show you here, you have some space for tools here you can storage the markers i received the champagne color but i think there is also pink and so more more colors looks really really professional and really stable i'm really happy with at the moment i'm really happy with this machine really curious to see if it's a good comparison with the silhouette portrait so i'm going to make more videos about it so right now I think I'm going to open also the printer and then I need to, uh, to, to <laughs> you look at my studio it's like now a mess so there are boxes all over the place I moved this from underneath my desk so I need to put this in place there are things uh, really all over all over the place so I I need to set up and uh, yes as I told you that box um, this one here was on the desk before so I have all my paper over there at the moment and I really need to understand how to <laughs> to set up my studio again I think I will need some time to to figure it out but at the moment I'm really happy uh, with the machine are the, the ink bottles there are two magentas two cyan four blacks and one yellow and this one, I have no idea, <laughs> I will check. And so, yes, I will uh, now fill the printer and then we will start and try to print with this baby. So I open up all the ink bottles and now I'm filling the first slot over here, the black. And then I will move on with all the other colors. I would like to print out this illustration so uh, let's see I'm really curious about the um, the quality of this printer so let's go ahead so this is the print and I'm so happy with the quality look at these the colors are so vibrant and the colors are really the same that i can see on the screen so from the screen to the print the the colors are the same and this is really important so i'm really happy this was only the first trial with the printer but i am really happy so there will be some new prints <laughs> coming uh, on the shop so stay tuned <laughs> this month digital goodie for my patron i thought about making uh, some stickers and some gift tags so that uh, they can use it for christmas for wrapping their gift it is usually just one so i just repeated two so they can uh, print two on one sheet and they have enough tags and stuff to use i think it's uh, really really cute and so now i'm going to prepare the post on patreon and so that they can download it right away today i've also printed some postcards for my patrons so i just need to cut them 
and then I will uh, write a message on the back for this month they will receive some extras because uh, it's Christmas so I thought about including some extra goodies and just a quick update on the uh, Cricut machine I'm trying to print the sticker sheets but they are not uh, cutting correctly As I don't know if you can see but the cut is more down here for some reason I have no idea I need to figure it out so this is a bit annoying I thought that I would have uh, this kind of problem because when you have a new machine a new cutting machine you need a lot of time to figure out how does it work with your paper and how to fix some problems so I think that uh, since I need to print all the stickers for my patrons a little bit sooner I will again use the silhouette portraits for this time and um, I need more time to to work with the Cricut. I don't understand why they make these machines and they are always so complicated and you need always some turnaround to make them work. So it's a bit annoying. I would just wanted to give you an update because also when I filmed the, un the unpacking, the unboxing video and I printed some uh, stickers for the first time, they they came out perfect. So. <laughs> I don't understand why on the second trial of uh, cutting stickers now they don't work anymore so I have no idea I need more time to figure it out and so I will come back to the uh, good old uh, silhouette portrait for now mm -hmm. 